Hello everyone, Mike Money Gamer here, and I'm here with a Let's Show Off. Today's game is Musha. Uh, it's a Sega game that I was hoping would be um, similar to uh, Truckstone, but it's not. So let me just show it off though for entertainment purposes. Oh yeah, and um, just uh, ignore that. Sega... I don't know if this is a game that you're supposed to play with a GameCube controller or not, I don't know. Let's see. Music, stop, game level hard, sound, whatever. Okay. And instead of doing a continue, I'm just gonna do game start. Let's stop the events of the enemy's mobile base. I don't know why, but I can't shoot with this controller. Um. Okay, it's X. Okay, that's why. I got pretty lucky then. Anyway, um, now I've only played a little bit of this game, and what little I've played of it, um, I can honestly say I don't like it. Um, as you see, um, it's very easy to die in the game. Um, in fact, I think I'm almost out of lies. Yeah, I am. So yeah, just to tell you how difficult this game is, you can tell. I don't know what they were thinking when they made this game, Sega, in my opinion, because it just seems like a joke, in my opinion, compared to most games of its kind. And I've even tried uh, playing it like two-player and stuff like that just to see if it's any easier on two-player and stuff like that, but it really wasn't. If you hold down X, you'll shoot like this. Oh, cool, I got a secondary shooter. I'm not sure that does me any good. Now before you make fun of me, like, saying, Oh, Mike, I'm sure it's just because you suck at this kind of game. You're right, actually. I do suck at this game type. Um, the funny thing about that is that um, I'm not that terrible at it. But I'm still terrible enough that I die a lot. <laughs> anyway, I'll show off one more pathetic attempt. And we'll see how it goes from there. Whoa. I don't know what it means in like the upper part of the screen where it says like form and stuff like that. Oh. As far as I know that's like supposed to be like if you're playing multiplayer. But since I don't have Anybody playing here with me right now? Well, that's not important. Oh, 
Oh, I did even better for a while there. Anyway, enough of this. Let's um go to something else real quick. Let's see, what else do I have on here? Um... <laughs> you wanna see me fail at Castlevania? Let's do some Super Golden Ghost. I don't know how far I got in the game. You will need the classic controller, I got one, so don't worry about it. I know I started a game on it, but I think I'm only on, like the first level. Yeah. I got the arrows, which are one of the um, um, better uh, weapons in the game, in my opinion. And in this game, you get a double jump, which is kind of cool. What I can't believe, though, is that they released this one on here, but they didn't release one of like the sequel before it, you know? Anyway, jump up here, because if you go down there, you get stuck in that gate and die a lot. Just trust me, I know this. Uh, torch, that's not gonna help me. Oh god. <laughs> I'm probably just gonna be like, let's show the off games in this episode of Let's Show Off. <laughs> As you can tell, I got game over. Um, this was actually uh, voted one of the hardest games of all time, if you can believe that. Which you can't, and I'm surprised at you, because it actually was voted that. As a cool fact. When um, the developers of this game, I can't remember who they are at the top of my head. Uh, they wanted to make a Sega game that was like, you know, super difficult, and they came up with this. And it's always been one of those games that gamers remember and are just like, oh god, I remember playing that game and just wanting to kill myself after playing it, <laughs> you know? Um, truthfully though, oh, I keep expecting B to be attacked, I don't know why. Uh, though, uh, if you want to see a completed Let's Play of this, uh, I think Nintendo Capri Sun has one up right now. Or should I say, have one up. He should still have it up, though. It's one of his, uh, previous Let's Plays, so it should be still available. God. making an ass out of myself. But you know what, it doesn't matter. I needed more content for the uh, videos I was doing, so this is what I came up with. Nope, that doesn't work. <laughs> oh well. Let's try this again. Yeah, if you don't know the story behind this, by the way, um, we're playing as... I'm trying to remember. Um, I want to say Arthur. Of the round table. And we're supposed to be... Um, Saving the uh, princess because she got kidnapped by these creatures. God. And 
and um, basically um, along the way you find all these awesome demon destroying weapons, you know, or monster destroying weapons, whatever you want to call it. And um, if you ever played the original for the uh, Sega, the regular, uh, the original Ghouls and Ghosts. Um, you probably um, like that one better than this one because that one uh, was a little bit easier in my opinion. Man, I'm getting massive slowdown. I ever got in this game was one of the um, like the checkpoint of this area, and then I got a game over and had to start at the beginning. So if you can believe, if you can imagine how difficult it is just from that, then yeah. Though I'm sure you guys have played this game and got all the way to the third level before you died because you guys are such badasses. <clears throat> I don't want to hear that if that's the case. Uh, I'm just having fun with you guys. Actually, I really don't care. I'm only here to enjoy myself, or at least try to. Even though it doesn't seem like I am, I actually am. <laughs> Why did I jump into that? And then I jumped into that because I wasn't thinking. That was awesome. Now, I think this game, if you, uh... For the grind points, you could get a one-up by doing so. But why would you do that? That's not fun. <laughs> there we go. Well, I haven't lost my suit yet, so that's good. Yeah, the bow, besides being the honest to goodness, actually weakest weapon in the game, is one of my favorites because just how much of an error you can spread with it, you know? There's, uh, your starter weapon right there. I don't know if I can get by it. It's an average attack, and, uh, you can only throw a few of them at a time. Oh, you guys are gonna hit me. I think this team's actually gonna cancel a lot. Isn't it? Oh, I really want that. Oh god, that's close. As you see, it makes your uh, weapon stronger. I think in the other game, you're actually able to uh, throw things up. But you can't throw things straight up in this game, as you can in that one. Alright, here you gotta stand on these, right here or you die. Oh. Just like that. 
you gotta be very careful about your jumps because, you know, your momentum will throw you off, but we died, so we have to get sent back here. Hmm. How are we doing on time? We're almost to the time limit that I use this set for these. God damn it. Butt's falling asleep too. So is my leg and everything else, but that's not important. I might have to cancel my plans for tomorrow since I'm staying up too late. That would kind of sucks. Not that it matters, I guess. It's not the end of the world having to cancel my plans. Anyway, that's enough of this nonsense. Let's get out of this and um, call it a night, what, did, what you say. So let's show off Musha and um, Super Ghouls and Ghosts is complete. I hope you guys enjoyed these little show offs. And um, since I don't really do a whole lot of them anyway. And uh, since that was enough for this video, I think we'll be good. So in the next day, uh, next time I see you guys. We will get more videos going. Till then, bye.